Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am your host, the most famous YouTuber in the world that no one has ever heard of. Okay, we are back on the Model T. We have a little bit of a problem with it. Grabbing, jumping, I don't even know what you'd call it. But last time, I swear, it is never quiet here. I'm going to make up t-shirts with that. It's never, ever quiet here. Okay, last time we took it for a ride. It did a little leapy, leapy thing. I'll see if I can put some footage in here. See, now that's not supposed to happen. I don't know what's going on with this thing. Something's grabbing in the transmission. I'm not even pushing any pedals. Wait for the school bus to go by. And we're back. Okay. Talking to someone who deals with transmissions more than I do. Uh, the question was posed, does this have turbo 400 uh, transmission clutch pack in it? And it does. I believe it does. So, um, <clears throat> I asked why he asked that question and apparently they stick when they sit for a while and this has been sitting for the dramatic is he all right pause a while um, this is the barn find car the green thunderbolt whatever you want to call it back in 2008 and 2009 it was Featured in magazines, uh, Model T Times, Vintage Ford Magazine, and many, many club publications around the world. So, fairly famous vehicle in the, uh, in the club circles. I have decided to put it up for sale. So, if anybody's interested, I'm not giving it away by any means. Uh, I tallied up what it would cost for the parts to build another one and that's what I came up with for the asking price um, if you want it pretty much all my labor is going out going out for free um, let me know if you want it now back to the problem I got my supplies out because I think I know what I'm gonna do Back in the day, if you don't know what that is, you're about to find out. Uh, back in the day, my grandfather, who uh, taught me most of what I know about these cars, used to run three quarts motor oil, one quart transmission fluid for the bands in all of his cars for, for decades. And by decades, I mean half a century or more. Uh, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to drain out a quart and I am going to put in a quart of transmission fluid and I'm going to run it for a little bit to see if that herky-jerky, I don't know what's going on there, goes away. I think it will. If my friend's correct about the transmission discs, I think it will go away. Um, and if that doesn't work, I don't know. I don't know, uh, sell it as is, I guess, knock a couple bucks off the price, or tear it down and build something else out of it. I'm not sure what I'm going to do if that's the case. So let's get to it. There's no easy way to film this. So what I'm going to do, hopefully, is I'm going to, hopefully that's in frame, hopefully that. I think it is, okay. Let's try that. The jar ready. Oh, oh we're getting old. This rod, this one should be empty. Well, we get a little bit. 
the oil is supposed to be between these two petcocks. So this one should well, that's thick, huh? Taking, there we go, there's the flow. What's going on here? There we go. I guess the petcock's gummed up a little bit because that should come firing out. We'll let that. We'll let that drip. little bit and uh, when I'm a quart low we'll add some uh, transmission fluid in a little longer than a few minutes later <sighs> it was 29 degrees out last night so maybe that's part of it maybe there's crap in the No, it looks like that's just what it wants to do. Many hours later. Okay, like, it's been like two hours and 5,000 cars. I don't know if this camera's picking it up or not. It's horribly noisy here. So I'm going to shut our... I use my tool. I'm going to shut our pet cock there. Make sure it's shut nice. Now we've got our oil out. Oh, oh sorry. Walked your brains. Okay. Let's not spill this. Oh, the camera's just turning all its own. Lovely. That must have been a great video. So there's our oil that we took out. It's got like 10 miles on it. I need a funnel. I'll tell you, this is fascinating video I'm sure so now we're going to put our quart of transmission fluid in the car like I probably should have done when I filled it the first time you gotta listen to the old timers oh, I gotta wash this funnel Hang on. Okay, funnel clean it looks dirty but it's not hold on let me get you down here What on earth is going on with this thing? I have no idea what just happened to the camera. But if it didn't come out on... It is never quiet here. Okay, if it didn't come out on camera, the, the screen froze. It should be... Life in the big city, my little farm town. That's right, this is a farm town. Until all the city people rolled in. Now I get non stop noise. That beeping was at somebody with a bicycle going past the house. And apparently, the Jeep coming the other way didn't like the bicycle on the other side of the road. So there were words exchanged, and I'm going to have to block, bleep that out if it came out on camera. Never, ever, ever quiet here. Alright, All right, we got that done. Now I'm going to have to run it for a little bit. So it's going to be... The 
the next scene in this video is going to be a few days from now. So we'll uh, we'll go with this. Start it up. We'll run it a little bit, and we'll see if that problem goes away. <laughs> 